Uh, yeah. Good job. M making out pools. Uh, now it's the rematch. Dog versus Kip. We saw this. This time we're going to Battlefield. Did we go to Battlefield the first time? Uh, I want to say they went to Yoshi's. Remember, it was like I was wondering why they decided to go there. It was so volatile. Or was that another Fox Falco matchup? I think this was the only Fox Falco. And that was three up smashes into an up air. After 12, 13 years, it all just kind of starts to blur together. It's all it's all the same space animal. Space animal number 507 and space number 508. Nice SDI out of the. No, they actually are playing very well. Red, the two almost ledge. Yeah, I mean, that's just like a really easy confirm. You know that he sees him coming towards the stage. I'm going to dash attack because it's high priority. I know it's only going to pop him up a little bit. And uh, it's just a really easy convert to get that smash afterwards. Oh, really good angle. Oh. Ooh, uh -oh. but he saved them, but. Uh, there's a chance. Oh, He's the back. trade. The trade of champions right there. Yeah, Fox has got to be kicking himself over that. But he can get the kill right now, and it won't matter. Oh. It still doesn't matter yet. Oh, it kind of matters. Not that much. These lasers don't count. And yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah, just wave dashing when he thinks the Fox Falco's going to go in. Oh, uh, it grab matters big time now. Oh, the super matters. <laughs> That's rough. Let him back, get back on, and you see what happens when you let a space animal get second win. This is strange. When one of them is on top platform, the other one comes up to try and attack him. And it's always a matter of who wins that. You'll, you'll notice. That was interesting. I kind of wish the Falco went for up smash there. I feel like up smash is one of the most underutilized tools that Falco has. It's actually really good for Blur combos. Uh, usually I find like the first hit of fair is only really no, good. No, uh, up smash. Oh, up smash. Yeah. Place it fair for flutter kicks. Uh, up smash? Yeah, they're good. Um, well, actually, I think there's many things you can do besides up smash. It, it, it's just like a situational tool, but it is like there are situations where up smash is the best option, though, is what I'm trying to say. Okay. And a power shield that did nothing. Ooh. Man, those auto cancel back airs are just unfair. Falco needed to refresh the invincibility. I like that. Jump. He jumped towards him with the shine and got the turnaround uh, back air uh, out of it using the shine to turn around. That was nice. I like it. I kind of like those up to ledge guards. It sweeps up underneath, get a little scoop, a little ice cream scoop. But you can sweet spot underneath those. Okay, did, I didn't want to say Scoops Hagen does, okay? It's not my line. Wait, is that banned? Scoops Hagen does? Yeah. Is that banned on commentary that I don't know? Oh, uh, it's just a, it's a famous line from a Marvel commentator, Yipes, from the Marvel 2 days. Ah, uh, so from what I understand, it's banned. All right, so going into the match, <laughs> uh, I really like that option. Just jumping in and then shining. They never expect it, but uh, it's really good because it's completely safe. Not to mention, uh, for, uh, jumps take one frame in midair. Your double jumps are one frame, so it's really safe. Fuck. Ooh, ooh, that back air was that. Uh, fuck. That falling back air was spicy. Falco was just getting in the corner, and that's not how it should be. That's why you. That's why you lose is when you're in the corner. And we're going to FD. So I guess the Falco was like, you know what? <laughs> what a beautiful start to the match. And the salt in the wound is that uh, that actually does more damage because it's reflected. So you got a full 5% instead of the normal 3%. Uh, these chain grabs, though. Ooh. Ah. He went for the jab reset, which was really smart, but the Falco got the DI up and was able to land. That was great. Ooh, reverse back air. Oh, the Falco man. tried so hard. Yeah, this. I have such mixed feelings about this stage. Like, my heart, I feel like this is still even because it's Fox versus Falco. It should always well, be even, but the chain grabs, the chain grabs are tough. Well, from what we saw, we saw him on Yoshi's, we saw him on Pokey, and we saw him on Battlefield, so I guess the Falco was like, let's try final. Just wanted to this, fox, this Fox knows how to combo on FD. Ooh, I like the forward tilt. Nice shield DI. 
Now, now, now this Falco's getting it on. Now he's getting a little bit of his confidence. He, had to, he would have to drop down lower in order to get, to get the back air. That's what he wasn't doing beforehand. That, uh, that was questionable. Oh! Almost caught the coverage. That the almost worked. Oh, that would have been beautiful. That would have been the most beautiful mistake. I really hope he didn't do it on purpose. Uh, he probably was going for a shine because the shine would have been much better there. It's like one of those things where it's like so stupid that it actually might have been a good idea, except when it wasn't right there. There's a uh, quote from uh, one of the old uh, presidents of uh, Coca-Cola. They came out with new Coke, it sucked. Came back out with the old Coke, and it was even more popular than it was before. And they asked him if he did it on purpose. His response: I am neither that dumb nor that smart. Oh, the marketing team probably did it though. <laughs> Pretty sure that's what actually happened. I feel like that happens a lot in the Fox vs. Falco <laughs> matchup. They do something crazy and it ends up like working out. It's like, wow, did you do that on purpose? Look, I'm neither that cool nor that stupid, all right? I feel like mostly it's just the Fal Fox getting most punish and actually able to take the kill while the Falco can't really get the kill on. The Falco can't get the kill on the Fox. Aww. But you know, sexy up B, I really like it. It's mostly just a mess up by the fox. Ah, oh, I like that. Um, Suicide. When you have the when you have the stock lead like that, I mean, it's just a no brainer. Like you get aggressive with those edge guards, and you cut off a lot of options that they have. And you just can't do anything.